hey hey everybody welcome back to another video today's video was sponsored by qvr hair i am adding in this boho natural well this boho braiding hair to the ends of my locks doing something a little different here's the packaging i'm going to show y'all the hair outside of the pack and this is still from the very first pack i'm still on the first pack and most of the back of my hair is done see there was a little shedding nothing too crazy and it's not bad on tangling so i'm gonna walk you through this one as you can see my ends are loose boom there it is so i'm gonna section off just a little bit of hair i don't need much for this style And this is how it looks. The end is really blunt. And then showing you the curl. Then I'm going to take my spray bottle with just some water in it and just spray the tip of the hair so it's easy to use. And as you can see, it flattens out a bit. So now I'm going to take that and I'm going to braid it onto my hair. So two pieces are going to, well, one piece is going to be along my hair is going to work as a strand and then i'm going to add my hair to the extension and i'm just going to braid that on down until i get almost to the end of my natural or to the end of my lock as you can see I'm going to stop about right here. Then I'm going to take a very thin piece and I'm going to wrap it around maybe two or three times before I put a knot in it. There we go. I can't really explain how to do the knot, so I'm showing you. I just know how to do it from braiding for so long. And then I'm gonna take my crochet hook. I don't have anything smaller, so I have to go in with the tip of it first. I'm gonna go in right above where I put that knot. And then pull the hair through the braid for more security. And I got this method from Dreamlock. She's also on YouTube and TikTok. I'll have her information in the description box. Here I am doing another knot just to make sure, and as you can see, I tugged on it, make sure it was in there. And now for this flyaway hair, because it's thicker, I cut that off. Just be careful not to cut the braid. And there we have the extension. And now I'm just going to let you watch the little montage of me putting some of these in, and I will see you with the finished product.
all of this is only one bundle. One bundle. So I'm going in with bundle two, just for this section. And just for reference, I'm gonna, just for reference, I'm gonna show y'all what this one bundle looks like. For reference, this is what the bundle looks like. So let's get back to it.
right, you guys. Here's the finished product. And let me just say, y'all know I've worked with QVR before. I've had the Afro kinky hair in different colors. I got a wig, which was the same texture hair as this. This is just me. I love curls. And this is what I have left of Bundle 2. So it don't even look like I used nothing out of this for real. And then I still have Bundle 3. So I still have almost two whole bundles left, which I was worried I didn't have enough hair. But... It's, it's a good amount of hair in here, especially you don't have to use as much if your locks are as small as mine. Because I some of these, it didn't seem like I used a lot, but the curls are so lush. So this is one and a piece of a pack, all right? Let's put, bring it all to the front. This is one and a piece of a pack. This is, this is it. And this is what the curls look like. They're so full, because as I was going, I was trying to trust the process because I've seen Dream Locks. Her locks are absolutely beautiful. I think she had wavy hair at first and then she ended up with a curlier texture. And then my girl, Mel, she did them. And I still think she used wavy hair too. So I went with the deep wave because again, this is, this is my texture right here. I love it. And trying to trust the process and I was just thinking like, oh, the curls aren't gonna be big enough and they're definitely big enough. And it's giving me the effect that I want it. It's also giving micro braids because the effect that I want it was I'm wearing a wig without wearing a wig because I'm trying to get out of wigs, especially since it's hot. I don't want to wear no wig. And that's that's what she's giving. She's giving micro braids. Yeah, she's giving micro braids. She's giving a wig. She's giving locks with curly ends. And I'm absolutely in love I don't know if anybody else has done this. I know it's becoming a thing now, like adding curls to your locks, but I've seen Dream Locks do it first, and this was about a year ago. And I didn't even know hers were extensions. I was just watching hairstyle videos and she came up and then I seen that she had extensions. So yeah, this is the hair while it's dried. I am gonna spray the hair now so y'all can see it wet. And I'm going to just focus that on the ends. I don't want it drenched, but I'm only going to put water on it today. I'll do another video on actually moisturizing it and keeping it moisturized. I'm just not in the business of that at this moment. I have been doing this today is day three, even though it only took because I stopped a couple times. It didn't take very long today, but So that was the hair dried. This is the hair wet. And again, this is 22 inches. I need to get these stragglers, let me see. So, on me. It's long. But again, you have to remember, I put this at the ends of my hair. My hair was already about eight eight and a half inches when i started my locks so this looks like about 30 inches of hair but again i am in love with it qvr but yeah y'all i am in love with this hair qvr thank you for sponsoring this video sending me this hair i'm just in awe it reminds me of the wig that i got from them as well i love this um so before I get into this 360, if you have any questions, any comments, you'll know what to do. Leave that in the comment section below. I will have all the details for the hair in the description box below. I thank you guys for watching this video and I will see you on my next one.
Bye.